Hello, my name is Dr. Carl Hartman. I'm an ophthalmologist and I am proud to be a member of the staff of Los Alamitos Medical Center. Los Alamitos Medical Center is an extremely fine institution with many, many fine doctors and they cover the broad spectrum, everything from surgery to medicine to all the subspecialties and it is a fabulous staff to be affiliated with and Los Alamitos and the surrounding area is a wonderful community to be able to serve. As an ophthalmologist, we participate in many different types of eye care. Not only is it surgical, but it's also medical. We treat kids, we treat adults, we treat everyone in between, and it is one of these specialties that I have been so proud to be associated and affiliated with because patients, by and large, come to us and end up with very, very wonderful, good results. One of the most common things that folks come to us for is blurred vision. Now, blurred vision can cover a very, very broad spectrum of entities. It can be just needing glasses. It can mean that they have an eye infection. It can mean that they have dry eyes. That's one of the most common things that we see. Or it can mean something that can require surgical intervention. Sometimes people come to us just because they want to eliminate glasses. That's a whole area called refractive surgery where we perform LASIK, or something that we call advanced surface ablation. These are the laser procedures that we use basically to eliminate glasses to enhance people's lifestyle. One of the most common reasons that people have blurred vision that requires surgery is for something that we call cataracts. Cataracts are the lens of the human eye that has become cloudy. All of us are born with a human lens. That lens is clear. And just like the eye has a lens, a camera will also have a lens, and we like to use that as an analogy in order to explain to patients what is actually going on with their eye. I'm going to take a step back here. People are coming in all the time and saying, well, I want to know, should I have my cataract out? Is my cataract ripe? And I always answer back to them, you can tell me when it's time to remove your cataract. It's time to remove the cataract again when you are unable to perform your daily activities, whatever those might be, whether that be driving or reading or gardening or watching television. When you are unable to perform your activities that you need to do day in and day out because of a decrease in your vision, then and only then is it time to remove your cataracts. So what does that mean to remove your cataracts? It's an outpatient surgery. It takes about 10 minutes. It's 99.9% .9 successful. The procedure is essentially painless. It's done through a teeny, teeny incision, less than a tenth of an inch. We dissolve the cataract with ultrasound. Once the cataract is removed, in its place goes an intraocular lens. And I'm going to come back to that in a moment because there are several different types of intraocular lenses that now can be offered. But we need to put the lens back in because just like a camera, if we remove the lens from the camera, you can't very well take a picture with just the camera body. It needs to be replaced by another lens. And in that same way, when we remove the human lens or the cataract, we need to replace that with an intraocular lens. So after we've done that, uh, a patch goes on the eye or a clear shield for one day, and the patient returns the following day and there are often no restrictions. Pa people are able to bend over, sleep on that side, do all of the things that in the past people have heard you're unable to do. Here at Los Alamitos Medical Center, I am very fortunate and honored to be able to provide comprehensive ophthalmology to the wonderful members of our community, both medical and surgical. It is a wonderful place to practice and it is a wonderful place to live. Thank you very, very much for your time. Have a great day.